One, two, three. In this piece, there are two main elements. The interval of a fourth, which was just introduced on the previous pages. In both hands, you'll find that interval happening as a key feature. And the other main focus is using the damper pedal, which is of the three pedals, the one on the right. So you'll press that down at the beginning of the piece, and you'll hold it down without changing it for the entire piece. Now, if you make happen to make a mistake, that's okay, you can change the pedal just to clear that uh, mistake out. Um, these are the fourths that you'll find. We're actually in kind of an A pentascale position with a thumb on A for the right hand all the way up to E for the right hand. So just all the white keys. And the same thing for the left hand, an A pentascale, but we're doing this just on the white keys. So it actually makes it into um, a minor pentascale. The two fourths that we'll find within this position are using the pinky where it is and the index finger, or the thumb and the ring finger. You don't have to pull your fingers away from the keys like I am doing here, that's just to show you with more clarity which fingers are playing the keys. So when you play these, it's best to keep your other fingers in place so that they're ready to go between each of the fourths. Same thing for the left hand, we'll start on the same interval from E down to B, thumb and ring finger, down to our next fourth which is pinky on the bottom and second finger on top. Note, at the very end you're going to move from this position up one octave. I'll play the song one more time. One, two, three. 